The next module we'll look at is the deleted file search module. A basic deleted file search simply involves selecting a physical disk or other device you have added to the case, such as a forensic image file, and clicking the search button. The default search will simply scan the MFT or master file table of the device for deleted entries. You can also enter a search criteria in the filter string box to search for particular file names. Keep in mind that the basic string searching option is case insensitive. For a deeper scan you will want to enable file carving in the config options. File carving will search for known file headers and footers when applicable for specified file types. Instead of finding files from the master file table, file carving looks at the raw physical disk data for file headers and attempts to recover files in this manner. This requires reading all data on the disk and is slower than the standard method. Once file carving is enabled, you can further customize how it performs. For FAT and NTFS file systems, OS Forensics has the ability to only index the unallocated sectors on the drive outside of the file system. This option and the only scan on sector bounds options are the default carving options when file carving is enabled. This can significantly cut back on the overall carving time as it will only be scanning the unallocated space and only on sector boundaries where the vast majority of deleted and recoverable content will be found. If you do wish to carve the entire disk, including the file system and outside of the sector bounds limitations, simply unselect these options before clicking OK. Keep in mind the only benefit to carving the file system itself is to recover data stored in file slack and depending on your investigation you may or may not be interested in the contents of file slack. The range selection feature simply allows the user to specify a specific portion of the drive to carve. This can sometimes be useful when dealing with a corrupt or damaged drive. The file extensions to be scanned list displays all default file types that OS Forensics can carve for. The default file types are loaded from the OSF underscore filecarve.confg file in the program data directory. The predefined file types have coded file recovery functions that will do a superior job than a straight header and footer match. Additional file types can be added or currently enabled file types can be removed. The default file types identified by light gray text in the list can be removed but cannot have their definitions edited. OS Forensics will carve user defined file types but will only look for header pattern and our footer pattern. Just like other modules, you can add results to your case in a multitude of varying ways through right-click and checking options. Again, keep in mind that where you see Add Results To or Export Results To, that these are only going to give you the list and some metadata on the files, but not the actual files themselves. To add the actual files or to save them to disk or a logical image, simply checkmark the file or group of files of interest Right click and go to the number of items checked section at the bottom.